Hello, hello. In today's video, um, I'll be walking you through my skincare routine. Um, I try to use a lot of products to cleanse, exfoliate, moisturize my skin. I know my skin isn't like the best, but I have never had like crazy acne or anything like that. So I would say my skincare routine is pretty good. So what I like to start with is obviously cleansing. So for my skin cleanser, I have recently started using this Forest Essentials Delicate Facial Cleanser. I'm gonna tie my hair quickly. So I got this recently and I just swear by it. Every time I wash my face, I apply the um, cleanser or the face wash on my skin and then I just use this to kind of scrub my skin. I like to go in circular motions. Um, I've always preferred a no makeup look or a super light makeup look. Just a mascara, some blush and a lip gloss. I don't like colored lips at all. I usually just go for a gloss or like a lip balm or something. I'm gonna wet this a little bit. And I'm gonna go again. I feel like my skin kind of soaks in the product with this. We don't even see the cleanser anymore in my skin. I'm just gonna wash this now. Okay, now I always use a separate towel for wiping your face. Now my face is cleansed and scrubbed. I am gonna use a face wash. I have a couple of face washes that I use. These days I've been using the Neutrogena Refreshingly Clear Face Wash. And I love the smell of it. I like that this does not dry out my skin at all. Now for the cleanser, I was trying to scrub my skin a little bit, but for the face wash, I try not to scrub it. I just gently rub it on my skin in circular motion again. Now I'll use this side of this product. Um, I'll just wet this a little bit. And then I'll just rub it around my skin. It is so like comforting. I'm not even kidding. Okay, now that I'm done with the cleanser and the face wash, I'm just gonna pat my skin dry instead of rubbing it. Okay, now I'll use this face serum. It's a collagen super serum by Tarte. I love this so much. It's my favorite serum so far. It is so hydrating. I'll... And I'll kind of just put like a few drops on my skin. Now, if you don't have a serum, you can always use coconut oil or something like that. Really, really good for your skin. Now, the reason that I put the serum is because I want to use my face roller and my gua sha. I know it's super cliche and everyone's just been using this, but I kind of feel like it is pretty soothing. It's like super relaxing to wake up, put some oil on your skin and just do this. So I kind of just have a routine of it. And I have no idea if this is the right way to do it at all. For my cheeks, I kind of just take this flat edge and go like that and kind of just pull it outwards and on this side as well from what i've heard you're supposed to do it in sets of three so i'll do it three times on this side and then three times on this side it does make your face red but it's it just feels good it feels like it's doing something to your skin um for my jawline and my chin area i like to do it like this just pull it like you can even hold this side and kind of pull this a little bit I'll just do the same on the other side as well. So the oil or the serum kind of helps like um, it slide like easily across your face, I guess. Which is pretty nice. Um, for this, I've seen like people do it upwards or downwards. I don't know. I do it like all directions, literally. Please don't like follow my um, directions. Just watch a YouTube video on how to do it or like read up online because I have no idea what I'm doing. But I just like doing it. My forehead as well. I'm just gonna kind of go like that. I 
this is what mine looks like the trick is i put both of these things in the fridge overnight or like after i'm done using it i kind of just wash it with soap and water put it in the fridge let it get cold for me to use it next time just take like the smaller side and go under my eyes like that and like that i don't know if you're supposed to do it like one direction both directions the big roller i mainly use it like that and on my forehead i love it when it's like kind of cold it's like cooling on your skin so then i use my face cream um i use the start drink of h2 it's a hydrating boost boost hydrant it is really nice but it does dry my skin up a little bit literally that much you can barely see it um then i rub it all over my hands and put it on my skin so after i put this hydrating thing on my skin although my skin is a little bit like dry it's not actually it's kind of oily right now because i've used so many products so when I usually put the serum and then the hydrating hydrating cream, it does not dry up my skin. But if I just put the cream on its own, it does um, make it like pretty dry. Like I need something on top of it. The next thing that I put is face mask. Uh, now I have a couple of face masks over here. I'm not super fussy with the face masks that I use. I have these from uh, Face Story. Today, I guess I'll go with the charcoal one. So I'll use the everyday charcoal. It's a detoxifying mask. So um, I know a lot of people put face masks uh, first and then their moisturizers. So I do it the other way around because I like for my skin to absorb the essentials from the face mask as well as from my moisturizer that I use. So I like to use it as like in one go. So I'm just going to apply it on my skin. Now, a lot of people also, after putting the mask on, they kind of just use the face roller. Just kind of pushing the essentials into your skin. Um, now, I also do like to put my face masks as well in the fridge. So that when I take them out, they're kind of cool and it's like cooling on my skin. While my face mask is on, I also like to put a lip scrub. Um, so I've been using this EOS, it's a guava lip scrub. So I'll see you in 10 to 15 minutes after it's done. Okay, it's been about 12 minutes and I think I'm ready to remove this. Uh, I'm just gonna peel it off. My skin feels so fresh. I'm gonna use a tissue to pat my skin dry. Okay, now the final step in my skincare routine is this skin mist that I put. It's uh, by Tatcha. It's a luminous dewy skin mist. It dries up super quickly, but it's like, it leaves my skin so soft. And JK, that was not the last step. Uh, the last step is this lip balm that I use again for essentials. It is a sugared rose petal with organic beeswax. So that is what my skincare routine is like. I know it's a lot of steps and I don't do these every single day, but I like to do this once in a while just to treat myself and spend some time on my skincare. So I just really enjoy doing that.